Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Sunny Ovi, and I'm here to do another missing child case. Now, oh Jesus, this angel was brought to me through my mom, actually, and I'm gonna give you guys a little story on how it was meant for me to read for her. Well, I was sitting yesterday, I was sitting at the kitchen table and I was like, oh my God, like I have to do a missing child case, but I don't know of who. Like I prefer for the angels to just give me a random child because for some reason they, they give me more insight when uh, a picture of a child just stumbles upon me or the name of a missing child. And so yesterday morning, my mom, she was talking about this girl on the news and how she was missing. Um, no, it was two days ago, excuse me, it was two days ago. She was talking about this girl on the news and how she was missing and that she was from Dinwiddie, Virginia. And I was like, yo, okay, like, what's her name? And she was like, Jessica Saunders? And I was like, was she black or white? And she was like, she was a black girl. And then a few moments later, there was in, um, there was something that came up on the news about a missing child in Dinwiddie and the name of the girl was completely different than what my mom told me and i was like but she was she was talking about the girl that i seen on the news and i was like okay let me look up jessica saunders and when i looked it up lo and behold it was a girl with that same exact name who was missing from dinwiddie and i was like yo this is a sign i have to read for her so yeah you guys um Please get this information out the best way that you can. Share this video. Do whatever. Um, yeah, I live like a couple minutes from Dinwiddie, to be honest. But yeah, let's pray, okay? Our divine God, Goddess, Angels, and Spirit, guys, call upon you. Please allow for this young girl to be found safely and sound. And if she is deceased, please allow for her soul to be at, to be at peace. Please allow for this insight to be great, uh, greatly helpful for her family and to be given to the police in respectful and open-minded hands who will be willing to take this insight and just really follow the directions of what I'm saying. Might have been God and angels, please, please guide me. Please guide me through this reading. Amen. Don't want to be. All right, you guys, I feel like this girl is alive. I, I read where she was walking from a gas station. The angels, they keep showing me a pickup truck. I, I feel like it was dark, okay? And the angels are saying she was dressed comfortably. She had her hair up in a bun, like maybe even had some sweat or baggy pants on and like maybe even a hoodie or like just a baggy shirt. Um, and there was an older man or maybe it was i keep picking up on like night or going into night i wanted to correct myself with that but the angels were saying that there was a man in a rusty looking pickup truck with a pickup truck uh it's like you need a ride and she was hesitant she was hesitant but she took it anyway and she couldn't get out the car and he's like, you're mine now, you're mine now. But the angels were saying that she, once again, she's still alive. She's in Charlottesville. She's on or near Stone Street. I keep picking up on like the word stone and street, but it's in Charlottesville. And this is the house is, has like a sidewalk and it's like near a hill but he's keeping her hostage and this man has two dogs older man older man he um the angels are saying he has had run-ins with the law in regards to DUIs and assault and battery But she's she's his like sex slave and she's like kept in a like dungeon per se. There's a lot of agony with her. I, I keep seeing a window but it's like boarded up. 
and I keep seeing her like do this all the time I wouldn't even be surprised if he keeps her in a box or in like a cage but I keep seeing her like in like a jail cell like thing but it's like a cage or this may be a metaphor for the angel saying that she's just locked away and I don't know if I said this before but this man he has two dogs two dogs that's what the angels are talking about too he's an older man he's really weird He's really, really weird. And I keep picking up on four, so I don't know if she's going to be found within the next four days, four weeks, four months, or within the month of April, maybe even four years. Um, but the angels are saying right now she is alive. Yeah. They're also saying that there's a good chance of her being pregnant as well, or she's fertile very fertile very fertile genes is what the angels are saying but i have faith that she will be found so yeah thank you so much for watching this video keep miss jessica in your prayers and i'll see you guys next video bye